What's up? You looking for the best tips to be able to dominate your friend, dominate the franchise league, and hold that trophy up? Well, look no further than my Patreon page. The link is also in the description. I appreciate all y'all, and we're going to start rolling out these shoutouts for all the Patreons that's been rocking with your boy. Patreon.com slash Fat Dollars ENT. This is where you're going to find all the exclusive breakdowns and everybody that becomes a Patreon will get a free Mad 19 ebook. Let's go. What's up gamers? It's your boy Fat Dollars bringing you some more Madden 18 tips. Today we're going to be focusing on shutting down the run because a lot of people going to run stretches, tosses, all that kind of cheesy stuff and I got an easy defense for you to run. 3-4-I, cover 4, show the cheesiest defense in the game and we just made it a whole lot better all you want to do is take your outside cornerback so if they in the left hash mark you want to take that cornerback man him up and move him all the way to the sideline that will change all the coverage and the zones behind them the run fits is 30 times better if you don't believe me just try it out now you can see me setting up my patreon blitz if you ain't a patreon make sure you go to that page right now and become one and you're gonna get a free copy of my first ebook on madden 19 so we setting up the blitz right now but we're gonna go over run stopping defense on this video and it's gonna be a lot of it he's gonna be real real mad he gonna pause the game about 12 times because he can't get his offense going with the run that's what a lot of people like to do they run the ball run the ball run the ball until something glitchy happens and they finally break it big that's what people call skill hopefully Madden 19 has a skill gap so what I like to do is come out in a run stopping whenever they in these two wide receiver or two tight end type formations look at my cornerback over there manned up hard flats on the field the deep blues in the in this defense play the run first. They stand still instead of dropping back. And look at that. It messes up his whole run gap. It's nobody for them to go out there and block originally on the play because the cornerback is all the way to the outside. I take him about three steps outside of his wide receiver. I don't bring him all the way up close because I don't want him to get beat deep. But when they're in a small package like this, people might try to hit you with these little glitchy out routes. So all I do is check his play. He got four wide receivers. That's when I set up the all-out blitzes, the 3 3 5. I'm in the Ravens defensive playbook. And there's nothing open. He has to throw it fast. We come down with a pick right there. Now, when you run the defense, you don't want to run it all the time. When they look at the defense, they're going to go through their entire playbook to try to find ways to beat it. Once again, he's in a small package. And look at this. All my, I got one, two, three, four, five, six guys in the area on the run. Now, if you don't do this, you don't see it being that effective. But if you do, look at me moving my guy to the outside. I don't want him to get beat over the top. I put him to the outside just in case. Now, he audibles out of it. He can't get his run going. He tries to sneak a run in. And look at the block sheds. Look at how everything is stuffed. Fourth and 13, he has to pass the ball. If y'all want to break down to all my setups, all my different defenses, let me know. The Patreons got the first couple steps, and I'm getting ready to drop this cover four breakdown for them. It's all love. Get in practice mode. Go online and try it out. Let's go.